Umar radiallahu anhu says, when Abu Bakr became Khalifa, this is extremely beautiful by the way. I want you to actually put yourself in Medina right now. You live there, Abu Bakr is the Khalifa. He leads the Salah, he leads the prayer. He said every day after Fajr, Abu Bakr radiallahu anhu would go in an opposite direction of his house and he would go deep into the desert. It was very curious. Right? What does he do out there? So Umar radiallahu anhu said, I'd watch him every single day. He'd go to Salat al-Fajr and then Abu Bakr does not return home. He just walks far away into the desert. So he said, every day I'd wonder, ila aina yakhruj. Where does he go? Where does he go? Where does he go? He said, one day I said to myself, la atba'ana. That's it. I'm going to go follow him and find out what he's doing. I just can't get over this curiosity of mine. So Umar radiallahu anhu said, I kept the pace from him to where he was at the end of my eyesight. Meaning I, I walked just as far away to where I could still see him. And then he said, I saw him go into this beat up old house. So Umar radiallahu anhu said, I quickly went and I hid behind. And he said, he spent a long time in there. It wasn't like a short amount of time. He spent a long time until after the sun was up, meaning it was getting hot. This is after Fajr, this is way past Duha, way past sunrise, and it got hot. And then Abu Bakr radiallahu anhu left the home and he made his way back to Medina. He said, this is way out of the city of Medina now. This isn't even the city of Medina right now. Way out of the city of Medina. So Umar radiallahu anhu said, I waited until I could no longer see him, meaning he made his way back to Medina. And Umar radiallahu anhu said, I knocked on the door, okay? And he said, this woman opened the door. She was elderly, she was frail, she was blind, and there were a bunch of little kids running around, okay? So I said to her, As-salamu alayki, ma sha'nukum ya amatullah. So peace be on to you. What is your situation, O servant of Allah? And she said that I am a blind woman, and I have no one to take care of me, and I also have these orphans with me. You know, and the implication, Allahu Alam, her kids died, left behind, these are her grandchildren, or these were orphans. Somehow, it's her, and it's some orphan children. And she says, I have no one to take care of me, and these orphans. Umar radiallahu anhu said, who is that visitor that comes to you every single day? The answer, she says, I don't know who he is. لا يذكر لي اسمه أبدا. He never once shared his name with me. <laughs> He never bothered to tell me his name. Umar radiallahu anhu said, well, what does he do? Qalat jazahullah khair. She said, may Allah reward him. Every morning he comes. Listen, by the way, she details. Him. She says, he cleans my home. He washes our clothes. He grinds our wheat. He bakes our bread. He cooks our breakfast. And then he leaves. Subhanallah. Think about that. If this was the only narration we had about Abu Bakr, it's incredible. <laughs> Seriously, the leader, the head of the ummah, the khalifa, the most important man in the ummah right now, with his station, with his status, and he goes out every morning to this house, and he doesn't even tell the woman what his name is. He's just, just consider me a secret fa'il khair, right? Just some good doer. Washes the clothes, cleans the house, grinds the wheat, bakes the bread, cooks the breakfast, and then makes his way back to govern the ummah. That is absolutely incredible. Umar radiallahu ta'ala anhu says, every single day, <laughs> Like, is this really what he does every single day? She said, every day, may Allah bless him. Umar radiallahu anhu said, do you pay him anything? She said, nothing. Umar radiallahu ta'ala anhu started to cry. And he said, at al-khulafa'a ba'daka ya Abu Bakr. You have exhausted every successor of yours, O Abu Bakr. You've exhausted us. Anyone that comes after you is exhausted. <laughs> Because this is a standard that is impossible for us to meet. A gem here, by the way, very important. Can you imagine how many deeds of Abu Bakr that history has never recorded? <laughs> you know, the books of the fada'il, the virtues of Abu Bakr, the things that he used to do. Can you imagine how many of those secrets he actually managed to hide? And why did he not think of himself too good to still do that thing? And by the way, a lesson for all of us. If you're someone who does some khair that everyone knows about, you better have some khair that only Allah knows about. Right? You better have some khair that only Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala knows about. And let it be an involved khair too. Okay? An involved form of good. Not just a secret charity. But this is something that, that has a spiritual reminder and effect on him too. Right, Going and visiting this elderly woman and her orphans every single day and doing those things. اهدنا الصراط المستقيم صراط الذين لم تلين ليلا 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 ولا تعلم مامي what does mommy mean at the end mommy 
Oh, Amin. No, it's Amin. Amin. Okay. Okay. So, uh, let me try to um, uh, make it uh, clear to you. Okay. So, share screen. Okay. So, uh, I will go to share my screen to you. Yeah. Okay, till it will be opened. Okay, so repeat after me. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. No, after me, after me. Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen. Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen. الرحمن الرحيم الرحمن الرحيم الرحمن الرحيم الرحمن الرحيم مالك يوم الدين مالك يوم الدين مالك يوم الدين إياك نعبد وإياك نستعين. لا إياك نعبد. لا لا اسلول 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 نبي. إيه نوت الدنا الدنا نو إيه 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 no. Should the ha? Should the ha? Eh, the nasrat al mustaqim. Say it again. Repeat after me. Eh, the nasrat al mustaqim. But not say that tell ta no, this is not tell, this is ta. Yeah, yeah. You know, like you are Indian or Japanese. I saw that you are Japanese. It looks like have a narrow eyes. <laughs> okay. No, look, this is ta. I know there is no ta in Indian language, but you should pronounce it as a heavy pronunciation. اهدنا الصراط ط ط ط ط اهدنا الصراط المستقيم مستقيم نو مستق قي قيم مستقيم نو listen to me what is this letter what is this one كاف كسرة كاف كسرة mix Okay, Ka Fatha. Ka Fatha, it will be? Ka Fatha. Ka Fatha, it will be Ka. Ka Kasra, it will be? Qi. Mustaqim. 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 Okay, again. Ihdina Sirata. Ihdina Sirata. No, you didn't show it to me the hair. I think you are hungry. I think you ate one letter. You ate this letter. Eh, eh, Dina. Eh, Dina. No, eh. Again, eh, Dina. Eh, Dina. <laughs> Without shouting, I can hear you. I can hear you now. Okay, come in front of the game. In front of the game. Ehdina Sirata. Ehdina Sirata. Ehdina Sirata al Mustaqim. Ehdina Sirata al Mustaqim. Sirata al Ladina an Amta Alayhim. Sirata al Ladina. 
صراط الذين صراط الذين أنعمت عليهم أنعمت عليهم 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 غير المغضوب Yeah, but the ge is ga ga. Do you know when you gargling the water? Ah, oh, yes. Al maghdubi. Al maghdubi. No, show it to me. How do you gargling the water? How do you gargle the water? Like that. So, ghair al maghdubi. No, you are not gargling the water. You just, you know, you are gargling the water like. G -g 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 no, it's not that. It's. Gairi. No. <laughs> no, no, it's ra, ra. Say it. No, it's not that. It's ra, ra. Ghairi. 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 Just say ghairi. Yeah, ghairi. <laughs> it's a completely damaged now. <laughs> okay. Ghairi Ghairi Maghdubi Maghdubi Okay, it's a still gap. Okay, fine. Alayhim Alayhim Waladhalim Waladhalim Ameen Ameen Okay, let me check you in reading too. Can I see like if you are able to read or not? Okay, so now uh, I need you to read it to me this one, please. Read it to me this one. Um, uh, I, I don't know about that one. Really? You, you, you're not able to read something like that? You're not able to read this one either? I'm not wearing the glasses. Uh, no. What is that? Do you know what is that? No. They tell. I don't know anything. I don't know anything than that. Oh, really? Okay, so if it's uh, okay, so if it's something like okay, can you able to read something like that or not? No. Not. Okay. Salama, salam alaikum, sister. Who is the teacher who is before me? Which nationality? Indian or Pakistani? Indian, Indian. Oh Indian my, oh my gosh, I'm very scared about the Indian guys. <laughs> it's the damage of the alphabet with this girl. <laughs> Okay. Um. The thing is, they, they studied in the Islamic school one year before. Uh. After okay. that, from past one year, we are in Australia. So they don't have any uh, educators here. So from the school, they taught us a little bit things like Ali Bata. After that, they didn't teach anything. SubhanAllah, you know, like the main problem is what? Any small problem with the kids will become like big problem because it's stuck in their mind. Now you can see like it's need like a time to can I change one letter? It's stuck in her mind. So she is not able to read. Okay, so uh, let me take what, uh, who is the second one? Second one is here. What? Salam. what's your name? Okay, say it again, please. Fatima. Fatima, Fatima right? No, A A D I A. Fatima. Fadia, Fadia, Fadia. Okay. So, Fadia, can you tell me Surah Al Fatiha, please? You don't know it? Okay. Um, can you uh, can you tell me what is this letter? Uh, Alif. Uh, no. What is this something which is on top? Um, 
Do you know what is it? No. Yes. It's dhamma. Do you remember? Do you remember what is the dhamma? What is the sound of the dhamma will be? I don't know. Is ooh. Okay, fine. Tell me what is this letter? The the red one. Uh, this one. Yeah, no, no, not the red one, just like the blue one, the blue one. Ba? Ba, okay, fine. Te. Te, and what is this one? Di. No, no, this one, this one. Te. Te, with the tongue out, te. Te. Good, this one. G. J. Okay. H. H. Okay. K. No. K. 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 No, not K. Is K. No. Listen to me. Is Ka. 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 No, not ka because ka is this letter. This is letter ka. The other one is called ka. Very good. Again, ka. Say it. Ka. Okay, can you tell me what's this letter? I don't know where. Say. Okay, this one. Okay, I don't know that. Okay, how many how many sura you 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 are no like how many sura you memorizing? Uh, when you go to eat and breakfast, Surah. Surah. Surah al-Ikhlas. Surah al-Ikhlas. Al 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 Okay, do you know Surah Al Nas? Kul Auzu Bi Rabbi Nas. Kul Auzu Bi Rabbi Nas. Alikin Nas. Alai Nas. Mujadi Waswati Kajan. Alabi Yashkuru Indahu. Bismillah Rahman Yohim. Today we are going to start Holy Quran also. And today we will start from page number 6 on PDF Surah Fatiha, first Surah of the Holy Quran. <coughs> Bismillah Rahman Yohim. Bis in Bismi. This is uh, this is this word is made by joining Arfijar Ba Kasra B and the word Isam. Isam mean name. Isam mean name. And B is a arfajar. So with the name of so Bismi mean with the name. Or in the name you, we can also say Allahi. So Bismillahi in the name of Allah. With the name of Allah. Now they have used Ar Rahman. Allah have used here Ar Rahman. So Ar Rahman, the word is Rahman, and uh, with it we have uh, with it Al is used. So whenever we use Al with a quality, it means that this uh, no one this this has the, the most of this quality. No one can exceed the Rahman quality of Allah. So Allah is most Rahman. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. 
in the name of Allah which is most <coughs> sorry sorry for that just so Ar Rahman mean the most gracious and then again Rahim the most merciful so Bismillah Rahman Rahim mean in the name of Allah the most gracious and the most merciful then in the second in the first verse of the surah is the word is alhamdu again the hamd is mean praise and al when we added al with the hamd it will become all praise all praise then lillahi here the actual word is allah and uh, with it our figure li is joined it becomes lillahi so alhamdulillahi lillahi mean for allah lillahi for Allah Alhamdulillah all praises for Allah then Rabb Rabb means Lord Al Alameen Lord of whole universe you are Lord of all universe now we will note another thing here here they did not use Alameen Alameen mean uh, two universe or two a uh, two universe but they have used uh, Allah has used here Alameen which has mean all universes we don't know the exact amount of universes galaxies present in the sky we have not seen anything yet, yet. clearly we don't know very much about universe and the, here Allah has told that Alameen uh, all praises for Allah who is the Lord of all everything whole universe <coughs> Then next words are Rahman Nirrahim, the most gracious, the most merciful. You already know the meaning of these two words. <coughs> then Maliki 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 mean honor, honor, Jom mean day, Adin judgment, Adini judgment honor of the day of judgment maliki so allah is the honor of the day of judgment iyaka iyaka mean only you you already learned the zameer of ka fataka ka when we when we call someone when we talk to someone we say ka iyaka only you naabudu we worship so the word is actually Ya Budu. We have added Noon Fatana, it becomes We. A meaning of Noon Fatana is We. Na Budu, We worship. We worship only you. Iya Ka Na Budu, We worship only you. Wa mean and. Iya Ka Na Budu, Wa. We worship only you and. Iya Ka, only you. Iya coming on you, Nastain. Again, na is used for noon fatana is used for we. So Nastainu, we ask help. Nastainu, we ask help. So this was also told us that Muslim only ask help from Allah. They don't ask help from anyone else. Okay. So, we ask help only we ask help um, we only worship you and we only ask help from you this is the meaning of this verse then ehdina ehdina ehdi mean guide ehdi mean guide and noon fata alif na mean us ehdina guide us show us Guide us, show us. Asirat. Asirat mean path. Asirat mean path. Al Mustaqim, straight path. Al Mustaqim, straight path. So here Muslims are saying, Eh Dina Sirat al Mustaqim. Guide us to the straight path. Guide us to the straight path. When we know our destination, we move directly toward our destination in a straight path. But when we don't know this, our destination, sometimes we look at this place, sometimes we went to the other place. 
we are not sure about our destination so <clears throat> muslim now what will happen after this life that's what they follow a straight path and that straight path is the path of quran and hadith so here muslims are praying ehdina sirat al mustaqim allah guide us to the straight path and this straight path is the path of quran and hadith okay <clears throat> okay now in the next word sirat al mustaqim um, uh, uh, there is the definition of sirat al mustaqim so sirat al ladina an amta alaihim sirat path al ladina path of the people an amta an am you blessed or you should give mercy or you show your you shower your blessing ta on them alaihim on them path of those on those you are uh, bestowed your blessing the path of those on you which you bestowed your blessings ghairil magdubi nut of those ghairi nut of those alaihim ghairi alaihim in nut of those magdubi on which you uh, you became angry nut the path of those on which you became angry waladallin <coughs> nut those who lost their way waladallin nut those who lost their way so magdubi mean those people who knew that islam is a correct religion like the jews of the time of the holy prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam who now knew that the prophet is the last and final messenger still they don't embrace islam and dal in mean those people who think that they are on the right part but actually they are on the path of evil <coughs> so dal in mean those people may allah protect us from the both these categories of people i mean okay now do you have any question from this no okay so you already memorized this surah but and uh, now try to memorize this uh, with the the verse number for example you say verse number 1 alhamdulillah rabbil alamin then you will say second verse ar rahman ar rahim then you will say third verse maliki yawmiddin try to memorize like this okay okay and also next time you will uh, after uh, reciting this surah like with verse number then you will recite this surah with meanings for example you will say alhamdu all praise lillahi for allah rabbi lord al alamin of all universes like this you will uh, read okay Okay. How much time do you uh, need to prepare this? Mm. One day is enough. Okay, good. One day is enough. <clears throat> okay, another thing, on this page that you you see that all uh, alf words are written with black ink, but some words are written with green ink. Do you know the meaning of this? no i don't know okay these green uh, uh, alphabets are pronounced with bold voice with the uh, heavy voice okay so try to uh, okay. make your voice bold when you read these words read these words okay yeah. green words okay so next time you will uh, read this okay <clears throat>